OK, well, Mark, defeat here against Lincoln tonight. What did you make of the game? Well, a really disappointing few days because we've had two games back to back that we, we were desperate to take points from. Um, and to, to score one in the two games and not take anything is, is really tough for us. We, there was a period that we really wanted to go and get from. I thought we started the game quite well. I thought we were in the game. The penalty comes out of nothing, really. Um, puts them one ahead. We might have had one on gas earlier than he got booked for. Um, and then the second one, it's just horrible, isn't it? Deflection moment. It's just a horrible one. It's instinctive for a defender to throw your body in the way, but if you can't block it, you're almost better off trying to let your goalie make a save um, because that really makes it tough for us. And we know that the tight pitch here can be a really good thing for us, but when you fall behind against a team with their defensive record and counter attacking quality that they've got, you know it's going to be really difficult. And we struggled to penetrate in the game. We had a lot of the ball, um, built the game a lot, but didn't find the quality moments to go with tempo and open them up, break them down, hurt them, weren't creative enough in situations. Having said that, 2-0, um, Jensen makes one good save to his to his corner. We have a, a header at the back post, which we could do better with. Gas gets done for handball when it's hand by his side. He's in 1v1. It's been booted at him from about half a yard. Any of those moments go, it's game on. But then it ends, really, that period with them scoring off a set play, which is disappointing for us. So it becomes a horrible even in terms of the score. Um, and too many parts of the performances where we just haven't got that real verve in our attacking play at times. And we, you know, we picked a team tonight that had lots of attacking players in the team, but I don't think we secured the ball well enough when it went forwards. And I think we lost too many situations to penetrate um, and to get out of tight spaces. We got to areas um, which we wanted to. There were lots of, lots of things in our approach play to get to certain areas of the pitch that we just didn't finalise those attacks and in the end for a lot of the ball it's probably happened in areas that um, are, are comfortable enough for them to defend um, in the, with, with bodies around the ball and we turned over too many moments in the middle third against their block so um, in, in the end we, we weren't able to create enough from the ball that we had so really disappointing they'll probably go away thinking it's a really comfortable away victory um, I don't think it was necessarily that, that scoreline the game but it doesn't really matter it was um, and we have to be a lot better in certain scenarios to not let the game look like that because it's a, it's a poor defeat for us really against a, against a decent side but um, you know, we're, we're having a tough time at the moment for results and a few individuals for, for little bits of quality that we need we're, uh, we're struggling a little bit Yeah, it's another case of two fairly quick fire goals for the opposition which got us on the back foot and probably worked right into their favour in the way that they were able to sort of soak up the pressure and against us in terms of where we're lacking at the moment yeah, they weren't too far apart, were they? 15 and 30, something like that. Um, but yeah, like the second one, real deflection, and the, the, the first one, obviously a penalty. I haven't seen those two moments back, but uh, the sort of moments that really they weren't coming at the time. They weren't, it wasn't like we were under big pressure. I think the penalty is the first time we probably had to defend our box or get around our box. It came off a little period where they hurt us with a bit of a pattern that we, we probably knew was coming and we didn't quite get our structure right. Um, and the second one, the corner ends up coming from a phase where we turn the ball over in a forward passing moment. And we, we had too many of those moments where we didn't penetrate enough. And then the game can unravel really quickly. We've seen that you know, in Northampton at the weekend. The game can go away from you really, really fast. Um, and we have to do more to be the team that gets on top quickly or that creates more when we have the chances that we have. We had a lot of options in the first half or opportunities to cross the ball at the first man a lot of times, didn't quite work it out or left it hung up for the goalkeeper. So that quality to find moments when we needed it just wasn't there. As I said, a lot of our approach play got us in positions where we wanted to be, but we couldn't find the moments we needed to to, to create and finish a chance. It's just the way it's going at the moment, isn't it? In those crucial areas, the ball not quite falling to the right man or it's going slightly to his wrong side or just something's happening which just isn't allowing us to create that really clear opportunity. Yeah, but that's not luck. That's just like a bit individual quality, a little bit of confidence, but that's a bit of a myth sometimes. You have to back yourself or you don't. Um, and, and a little bit of it is just like how, how do we take a risk in those situations and things. So it's where we are. It is, it is where we are. We need more wins. We, we absolutely need more goals and we've had, we're on a bad run um, and we've gone too long or, or not enough wins in the in the run of games that we've had, but um, we are where we are, and um, we have to we have to get ready really quickly to wash it off. And the players have got to turn up and deliver a performance Saturday. Simple as that, um, because we want to progress in that competition. But certainly, we're unhappy with the run of league games that we've had, or the number of. Um, number of wins that we've had so far at the stage of the season we are. We're probably a couple of short of where we could be, should be, need to be. Um, 
but at the same time we have to know that it's tough for us it's tough for us and we're not a top team yet so we've got a long way to go to be a top team but we've also got a bit of work to do at the moment to be a team that can win win games against sides like this that are um, that have got some really good players one player that provided a bit of a spark was Glenn McConnell as he came off from the bench and sort of showed everyone why he's so highly rated from the academy. Yeah, to be fair, he's done that every time he's played um, and, and he's training well, so he's waited patiently for his opportunity, deserved it, um, turned over a couple of simple things, you know, quite easily, which was probably too reflective of us, but he gave us a burst and an energy and a, and a creativity that we were lacking and um, that was good, but um, yeah, look, it's on the wrong side of it. For him, his development, just totting up minutes is good and hopefully he can build to be a really creative player for us in time, but um, we, we've got a lot to do in the shorter term to make sure that we are on the right side of more results than that tonight. And as you say, now we're on to the FA Cup on Saturday, we know what the competition can mean to a club, so uh, it'd be fantastic to get that win and um, get a place in the third round. Yeah, we just need to win a game, we need, you know, we need, to, we need to play at a level that gives us a chance of doing it, not give the team a, a foot up in the game and uh, make sure that we play with a real intent, but when we're in a difficult situation and everything's against us or um, everyone's a bit down on us, it's understandable, but there's only one thing you can do which is roll your sleeves up and come out fighting and not only fighting but playing with a bit of quality and confidence and back yourself to do that that's the job of the players now to, to really go and back themselves and not go into a little little corner because we had the little international break and we wanted to come back with a real really good points return certainly in that period and to take none from those two games is a is a bit of a hammer blow for us um, but yeah what can you do get on with it and um, try and deliver the, the, the right level in the next game